Hi everyone, it's Helen here from Body Work Pilates and I have a couple of exercises I want to show you using the resistance band that will really challenge the strength of the lower body. So we're talking about the glutes, the hips, we're talking about the, the thighs, we're talking about the muscles that run around the knees, we're talking about um, everything from sort of pelvis downwards. So I've tied my band into a loop, probably about the size of my head. And I've double knotted it as well, so it doesn't um, doesn't come undone. I'm going to pop this around my ankles, making sure that the knot is off of my body because the knot on the body is just uncomfortable. Okay, so if I turn side on now, okay, I'm going to stand nice and tall. I'm going to find that lifted position, and again, as always, making sure that when I stand onto one side, I don't sink down into the hip, so I keep that sense of length lifting. Okay, I'm going to bring the other leg up so that I've got some tension between the ankles. Okay, and then standing nice and tall, I'm just going to try to extend my leg out, just as if I was flicking uh, water off my toes. So I'm looking to go from a straight to a, a, to a from a bent to a straight leg against the resistance of the band. Okay, so. The tighter you've made the band, the harder that's going to be. But there's a lot of work going on into my standing leg as well. So I'm just pressing the leg away, pressing the leg away. And you'll feel that in those muscles. So going into that final little bit of extension is really good for the muscles that support the knee. Working into the thighs, into the hips, around the glutes, into the stabilizing muscles of the pelvis. So there's loads going on in that one. And then, and I'm gonna use the edge of my tower here for a bit of support. You could lean against a wall or a counter because it's less about the balance now. It's less about the balance now. So I'm gonna stand again nice and strong into the supporting leg. I've wiggled my band now around my foot. So it's around the front ankle and the back foot. And I'm gonna slightly hinge forward from the hips, but I'm keeping a long line. And then from here, I'm simply pressing my leg away. It's like a, it's like a slow donkey kick. I want to make sure, it's not about the height that you bring it up, because I want to make sure that I keep my hips facing forward, back of my pelvis stays level. I'm just working not only into the standing leg, but now into the glute and the hamstring of the leg that's moving back. I'm gonna work obviously with a smooth and even breath. I'm not gonna hold my breath at all here. As I press away and then bring it back. And obviously you do the same thing on the other side. So a couple of little exercises there using your utility, your, your resistance band to really challenge the lower body. Have a go at those, see what you think, let me know. I'll speak to you soon.